This is a 16-year-old football player who injured themselves at practice. They're having some weakness and pain in the thigh, so we did an MRI here. You can see an unusually well-defined tear, the proximal rectus femoris, and it's a pretty big tear too. So these are not uncommon, but it is uncommon to see them so sharply defined like this. So this part of the muscle should sit right up here. So it's just a very sharply defined tear, and the muscles retracted back to here. This is a sagittal view. So here's the front of the thigh. Here's the femur. And you can see the muscle fibers that are retracted down. There's a black thing here. This is the central tendon. This is the indirect head of the um, rectus femoris muscle. There's a, um, a direct head, which is in the periphery. And then the more central portion, there's a central tendon and it connects to muscle. And that is the indirect head. So this is a large tear involves, I think, parts of both the indirect and direct heads. but. The whole indirect head is torn, and so that's why the tendon is retracted distally here, causing this dark area. Here we are up high. We can see this well-defined fluid collection here, a hematoma. This is the direct head around the periphery. Some of the fiber is still intact. Now here is the more central part of the muscle that's torn. And we're going to come down, down here, and now here we get into the indirect head. You can see how that indirect tendon is retracted distally because of the muscle tear, and there's a little... Um, muscle strain surrounding the central tendon there. This patient also had something else interesting. If we go up higher here, looks like they had, yeah, right in this area here. This is the lesser trochanter, and this is the ischium, and right between them we have the quadratus femoris muscle, and there's a high-grade muscle tear right there with some edema or hemorrhage at the site of tear. So that is it, a very sharply defined large tear of the proximal rectus femoris, and the retraction of the indirect uh, tendon, and uh, thank you very much.